Did you know there are plants that look like they're floating in midair, or others that smell like rotting flesh to attract pollinators? Some can even trap and digest insects to survive in nutrient-poor soils. Nature's creativity knows no bounds. From bizarre shapes and survival tactics to flowers with jaw-dropping sizes, today, we're unveiling the top 10 weirdest plants on Earth. Get ready to dive into a world where plants do more than just grow. They shock, amaze, and defy expectations. Carnivorous plants. Nepenthes, known as pitcher plants. Nepenthes are nature's finest insect trappers. These fascinating plants vary in size and shape. Some species, like Nepenthes ampullaria, have small, delicate pitchers, while giants such as Nepenthes raja boast robust pitchers big enough to trap small vertebrates like frogs and lizards. Their diversity highlights their adaptability to different environments, with some even hanging gracefully from vines in tropical rainforests. These natural masterpieces come in colors ranging from fiery red to lime green, ensuring they remain as eye-catching as they are deadly to their prey. Rafflesia arnoldi, the corpse flower. This Southeast Asian marvel holds the crown for the largest individual flower in the world, measuring up to 3 feet, 1 meter, in diameter. Its fleshy, crimson-red petals are covered in white spots resembling raw meat. To attract pollinators like flies, it emits an odor similar to rotting flesh. However, don't confuse Rafflesia with the Titan Arum, Amorphophallus Titanum, which we'll discuss later. While both are nicknamed corpse flowers, their sizes and structures differ. Venus flytrap, nature's snap trap, scientific name, Dianaea muscipula. The Venus flytrap is one of nature's most famous predators. Its snap trap leaves have tiny trigger hairs. Here's the clever part. The trap only closes if the hairs are touched twice within 20 seconds. An ingenious way to save energy and avoid false triggers. When it shuts, digestion begins almost immediately, breaking down the unlucky prey within days. Truly a masterclass in precision engineering by Mother Nature. Mimosa pudica, the touch-me-not. Mimosa pudica, or the sensitive plant, reacts to the slightest touch by curling its delicate leaves inward as if shy. This rapid response, driven by changes in water pressure within its cells, is an ingenious defense mechanism. While it can't feel pain like animals, its sensitivity to touch showcases a unique adaptation to its environment. It's a fascinating example of how plants interact with the world around them. Ghost Orchid, the floating spirit, scientific name, Dendrophylax lindeni. The ghost orchid's ethereal white flowers give it an almost spectral appearance, earning it its haunting name. These plants are epiphytic, meaning they grow on the branches of trees in humid swampy environments of Florida and the Caribbean. Without leaves, they rely on photosynthesis through their roots, which appear as if they're floating in the air. This unique adaptation makes it a rare and captivating marvel. Welvitskia mirabilis. A living fossil hailing from the Namib desert, this plant looks like a relic from another time. And it is. Welwitskia grows only two leaves that continuously elongate, creating a tattered appearance over its lifespan, which can exceed 1,000 years. It survives on morning dew and fog, a testament to its ability to thrive in one of the harshest climates on Earth. This living fossil truly lives up to its name, Baobab, the inverted tree, scientific name, Adansonia. Baobabs look as if they were planted upside down, with roots pointing skyward. Their swollen trunks can store up to 32,000 gallons of water, enough to fill a small swimming pool. Often called the Tree of Life, Baobabs provide sustenance, shelter, and medicine to countless animals and humans in their arid habitats. They're not just bizarre, they're life-saving giants. Heliconia. The lobster claw native to Central and South America, Heliconia dazzles with its lobster claw-shaped bracts. These vibrant red, orange, and yellow structures serve a vital role, attracting pollinators like hummingbirds, and even bats for some species. Their striking appearance adds a splash of tropical charm, making them as functional as they are beautiful. Dragon's Blood Tree, the red marble. Scientific name, Drachina cinnabari. Shaped like an umbrella and native to Socotra Island, Yemen, the dragon's blood tree produces a striking red resin. This dragon's blood has been valued for centuries as medicine, dye, and even as part of ancient rituals. Its alien-like silhouette makes it stand out even among the planet's strangest plants. Amorphophallus titanum. The titan arum. The titan arum holds the title of the world's largest unbranched inflorescence, towering over 10 feet, 3 meters. While often mistaken for Rafflesia, this plant is structurally different and boasts its own claim to fame. When it blooms, it releases an overwhelming stench akin to rotting flesh, luring carrion beetles and flies to pollinate it. Its rarity and size make it a once-in-a-lifetime spectacle. 
These weird and wonderful plants remind us of nature's endless creativity and resilience. From deadly traps to ancient survivors, the plant kingdom never ceases to amaze. Which plant blew your mind the most? Let us know in the comments and don't forget to subscribe for more jaw-dropping facts about our incredible world.